Hello everyone, this is Silix, welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Alright, so on the previous video, we um, met up with Mona, with Fischl, and we were going around, looking at the meteors, collecting a bit of meteors, uh, we even it's did a bit of like, meteor challenges and stuff stay like here. that. So, anyways guys, in this video, we'll be continuing with the quest, as they did release the quest this morning, so yeah. If you guys cool with this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more future Genshin Impact content, and yeah, let's get right into the video. to get rid of loads and loads of meteorites. Mm. Ah, good timing. There's something I need you to do. Buy me food. Remember how I was saying that the meteorites belong to someone's constellation? Theoretically, it's not possible for stars that are goodness knows how many light years away to suddenly turn into meteors and fall out of the sky. But however paradoxical it may be, this is the reality. If we want to get to the bottom of this, the best way is to find out whose constellation it was. Based on what you've told me, it seems that all victims of the meteorites fell into a deep sleep and all of them dreamed of a snowy mountain. Now, we may not know which mountain this was, but we can safely assume that it's not Dragonspine. Otherwise, someone would have recognized it, right? Did everyone definitely have the same dream? And where exactly were they in the dream? These are the questions that we need answers to. Mm -hmm. I need you to find out more details about the sleeper's dreams. The more information we have, the closer we can get to the truth. Okay. Seems we should head <clears throat> somewhere with lots of people around. That way, we should be able to find more victims to question. Lots of people around. I need Where to stay in them? an undisturbed environment. So, I will leave the investigating to you. Is there anywhere that we haven't been to yet? There is Chinksa village. In Liyue. Oh, I love that place. Although it does not usually match your suggestion of somewhere with lots of people around. That said, I suspect that the Millilith will have turned that area into a site where victims can receive medical attention. Much as they did at Wangshu Inn. Mm. That's my favorite place to go. Because the music there is just so like... Alright, let's head over to King's Village. Is this Madam Ping? Oh, no. <laughs> um, Jinglin, Lilith. Hello! Is it over here? We're from the Adventurers Guild. Can you tell us if Chingsa Village has been affected by the meteorite strike? Adventurers! Perfect. I was beginning to despair at the lack of helpers. These meteorite strikes have been going on for days now. Don't even get me started on how much trouble it's caused. If one lands in a field, no one dares to go and harvest the crops. And if one lands at the entrance, access is a complete nightmare. Do you have any ideas on how to safely dispose of them? They're just making everything impossible. Guess we'd better help this guy out. Mm hmm. Where are they? Alright, so. There's a couple in the area. Ah, uh, this, this, this thing's huge. Oh, no, because I have to like clear up these people here. Oh, Life I'm goes on. <sighs> I really forgot. I thought these guys would be much harder. They're only level 34 though. No. Not that hard. Oh! Come on, give me more people. Dude, my Razor is just built differently. <laughs> He's actually just way too strong. I think I could improve his gear um, by giving him more legendary pieces because he only has about three legendary pieces. So. I gave him uh, the other two different pieces. Um, he would be doing much better. Oh. What the hell? I want him on top of this thing. Oh. That sounded very weird. Okay. Oh, so it just disappears. Interesting. Alright, will this give me a bit. What the hell? Oh, okay. This is going to be a bit easier since I can use my elementals because, oh, the electro elementals because, um, the slimes are, you know, immune to electro, so this thing should be much easier. Whoa! Did you just for, like, shit? I think you just for, like, some next level, like, shit. Oh. Well, that was kind of easy. 
wasn't that much, you know. That wasn't, you know. I thought it'd be, you know, much more hard, but you're right. Done and dusted. Wonderful. Oh, what a huge help. Have any of the victims woken since the start of the incident? Oh, I, I wouldn't know. You're better off just taking a look for yourself. <laughs> okay. Where are the victims? Oh. Let's talk to this guy then. Wa Hua Ching. Wa Hua Hin. Hua Hing. How do you say their names? Mortal. Art thou also descended into the realm of suffering? Same situation that we've seen in other places too. Hey there. Has this guy woken up at any point? No. He has said a few things in his sleep though. What kind of oh. things? So cold. Can't go on. Things like that. Somewhere cold up in the mountains. Where could it be? Uh, I think I know where it is, but it's not on the map because, um, uh, it's not on the map, simple. It's, I can show you where it is. It's literally, um, it's here. <clears throat> no, no, no. It's, it's here. It's in this area right here. This area. It's like a little, it's like a frozen mountain there, but I don't know if we'll be able to go there. Because it's not on the map yet. Up at any point. Damn, bro, you need to eat more. Look at your face. Not so far. Okay. Your, um, has he your voice does not match your character appearance. Sleep? Now that you mention it, yesterday he suddenly cried out so high. Who knows what he was dreaming about? How high? High as a snowy mountain peak, maybe? A wicked mountain. Its frozen peak looming high. Home to a malevolent power. Let's talk to that guy over there. Which guy? This guy? Oh. Wait, what? I haven't said that guy over there, but he's all the way down here. What the hell? <coughs> uh, Mona? Uh, isn't Mona supposed to be here? Wait, I think the game's just like bugging. Hold up. Right? Because Mona's supposed to be here, right? You know what, let me just, uh, I'll just, uh, reopen the game. Technical difficulties, uh, here, I'm never gonna do about it to Mona! Guys. We found some stuff out! An ice-capped mountain looms over the world from far above the clouds. That is the place from which this burgeoning darkness proceeds. Ice-capped mountain? Is that all? It's a really, really high mountain that no one's ever seen before. And it's super cold up there. The sleepers are forced to try and climb to the summit, but they don't know why. Climb the mountain to the summit. What sort of person would wish to reach the summit of that mountain? And how is their desire strong enough to exert an influence on others? Perchance some poor soul lies there, buried in the snow, Hounded to death on the mountain. Or some intrepid explorer was exceptionally keen to conquer that particular mountain. Oh, I'll do another reading. What was that voice? Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. I see something here. It's a little vague, but Leonard. I think I can get his name. Ah, uh, yes. Leonard. Oh, Leonard. Wow, that was fast. <laughs> well, in <laughs> case Leonard. you'd forgotten, I am a genius. Oh, yeah, I could tell. Leonard. Hyman's never heard that name before. Hmm. <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, sorry guys. My throat's been acting up recently. <coughs> oh god, who's that? Sounds interesting. Mind if I join you? What ho? We meet again, vagrant of Inazuma. <laughs> My retinue and I were just... What was that? The first time the Millilith were present. 
I had to forego the chance to strike down Mondstadt's savior. This time was a perfect moment. I was mere seconds away. What? Soldiers! Sir! Sir. Find them, and when you do... Another one? My lord! It's happening again. This is the largest one we've seen so far. They just keep coming. But so be it. Move out. Change of plan. Your prior objective remains in force. Continue to research the meteorites. My lord, leave them to us. We will make short work of them. Are you deaf or just stupid? When did I give you the right to issue your own orders? My, my apologies, my lord. Now move out and complete your objectives as assigned. So this is the Harbinger. Any junior fortune teller could have told you this, but that man was a Fatui Harbinger. That was too close. How did you manage to get caught up with a guy like him? A Fatui Harbinger? Why, their wickedness knows no bounds. Damn. Whatever he was planning to do, he was heading straight for you. And he is an extremely powerful individual. I sensed it the moment I looked at him. He's far more powerful than you'd imagine, as much as it pains me to admit it. Surely his power cannot match that of the astrological genius of the century. I never said that. His strength may exceed mine by a hair's breadth, but in astrology alone, he doesn't come close. They must be plotting something. <sighs> maybe. Just maybe. Oh! The Fatui are the ones who caused the meteor shower in the first place. Was that it? Oh. Paimon, that was my line. <laughs> Sorry. Paimon's mouth just works so much faster than everyone else's. Yeah. Where'd they get the power to pull stars out of the sky? Yeah, what the hell? Osvaldo Hafnavines, what is thy opinion? Osvaldo Hafnavines. I think that anything is possible, main Fräulein. So long as they can afford to pay the price, they will never stop sowing their seeds of destruction across the land. Fatui, your sin shall not go unremembered. I also believe that miracles can happen. Astral Emissary, you have performed admirably as a member of my retinue. I will dispatch my forces to protect you. And they will ensure that the encroaching darkness shall bring you no harm. She means... me. <laughs> no need! Paimon thinks that our current lineup works just fine. No need to fix it if it ain't broke. That you underestimate true. me, Fischl. I'm far stronger than you seem to think. Main Fräulein trusts no one more than yourself, my lady. She is simply concerned for your well-being. Oh. There's really no need. In any case, you're in a much more perilous position than I am. If anything, you need my protection. Screw it, I'm official simp. <laughs> Naturally. For now, <laughs> we must deal with the new threat. My astrolabe tells me that a new meteorite has landed, and it's the biggest one yet. Okay. Head to the spot where the giant meteorite made land full okay. god that is a big meteorite what the hell looks like we made it here before the fatui quick there's no time to lose what the hell that thing's huge this is the one i sense an unprecedented amount of elemental energy within. The very heart of darkness descends upon the world. What do the Fatui want with this? Is it the elemental power? It's possible. But if that were the case, other life forms would surely be drawn to the meteorite's energy too. Okay, interesting. Interesting. To be continued. 
In the Fall Star Challenge, defeat opponents to obtain Celestial Energy. You can only hold a limited amount of Celestial Energy at one time. Once you reach the max, you will be unable to obtain more. I can't just read that. Uh, okay. I have no idea what any of this means, but uh, okay, I guess. Jeez, I still have so much stuff to do, like to collect and stuff. Oh my god, that's but it. Oh, that is a lot of images to collect though as well. Rotate the astro astrological signs to align the symbols. Rotate, yes. Wait, so I gotta make them the same? This. Oh, I did it. There you go. What did that do? I don't know what that did, but uh. Uh. I have no idea what that did, but uh. Okay, then I guess we'll uh, just uh, do single player because uh, I'm, a, I'm a champ as a single player. We'll clearly do this and then uh, we're gonna end the video right here, guys. Okay, so that's your energy submission. So collect and submit this yeah. energy. Let's just collect the energy. I like to collect the energy. I don't know how to All I know is how to beat people up. What do I do here? I just stand here? Oh. Oh, was I supposed to stand still? Oh. Don't attack me, don't attack me, don't attack me. Okay, there we go. Alright. Is that it? No, that has to be more, right? Or am I just missing something? Um. Oh! What? Oh, what the hell? Where'd you come from? Oh, I'm so slow. So I don't know if more specific energy is coming. Okay, now what? Can I submit energy? Uh, no, I can't. I have to wait for more enemies. Sacred name. What a rage. Hi. Okay, okay. Submit, submit, submit. This should be the last one. I'm, I'm pissing, pissing all right. This should be the last one. There we go. Finally. It took me six minutes on my own. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. What rewards do I get? No, 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 no. Rewards. What did I get? A lot of the spiky things, which... Okay, interesting. But anyways guys, I'm gonna end the video right here as we have done the story now. So there's really nothing much to do. My next video will be a Minecraft Let's Play video. So if you guys are excited for that, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more future Genshin Impact content. And yeah, Zilix, I'm signing out.